up you guys it's your girl tasha coming to you guys with a mini little zara haul but i got some fire pieces to show you guys of course i want to style everything up okay so if you're new hey boo my name is tasha i focus on fashion beauty and lifestyle mainly fashion plus size fashion apple shape fashion for my apple shape girls and so on my ogs thank you for continuously holding me down don't forget to follow me on instagram at tasha die b styles so this video is going to kind of be like a two for one i'm going to haul the pieces style them up but you guys also been asking me for date night looks so i'm going to give you guys the haul plus do the date night look so if you're interested boo let's get into it because y'all already know how i get down y'all already know how i get down so y'all need to spin first let me get y'all spin You need one more spin? I need that one more spin. Okay, so I picked up this sheer top from Zara in a large and I paired it with my satin slip skirt with a high split. I've had this for a while from Zara, so this is old. And then I paired it with my patent leather booties. And you guys know I recently picked up this Eloquy belt. Um, so how y'all feel? Like sheer tops are super on trend, but I told you guys before, like back in the summertime or well, fall time, getting ready to go into, well, summer going into fall. And I told you guys then that sheer tops are a thing, okay? So I got this sheer top from Zara in a large, and let me get up close so you guys can see it, okay? So it's giving all the things and this is how it looks up close. It has the ribbing. This is how much stretch is in it, okay? Now the shirt stops like right here. Okay, so it's not a super long shirt. So this is something that you would wanna wear like tucked into a skirt, tucked into a pair of pants, like, but it's very, you know, versatile given the things. So you guys asked for date night looks and it's definitely, a vibe okay you can always lose the harness belt if you don't want to do a harness belt but i just feel like the harness belt is giving a little extra little you know what i'm saying you know i'm not a basic bitch. so <laughs> i just made it with my black and white chanel bag because i feel like this is classic it really ties in the look but like i said you can always lose the harness belt for maybe like you know something else like a blazer but if i was to do a blazer with this look i think i would want a shorter skirt okay so how do you guys feel about this look y'all want more one more span let me get one more span All right, let's get into the next piece. Now, the next piece is an essential item. It's actually a basic, but the color is a little bold. So, I think I'm going to give you guys two or three looks with this sweater, just so you guys can see the versatility in it, even though it's a loud color. So, you guys want to see this skirt again, and then I'm going to give you guys two more, you know, options with this sweater. So, let's get into the next. Okay, you guys, I'm going to give y'all a spin. You need one more spin. Okay, so I have on this neon green oversized sweater from Zara in a large, and it is super stretchy. Like, it's a super stretchy knit, and I decided to do a French tuck. I have it paired with this, like, acid wash um, denim mini skirt from Fashion Nova, which is old, and then I have on my cream slouchy boots from DSW and that great clutch that I recently showed you guys from Amazon. So how do you guys feel about this look? So like this is a cute date night look like if you guys are doing something chill but you still want to be cute comfortable but give it a little sexy. You know what I'm saying? Get a little sexy. 
Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys how to elevate this um, sweater a little bit because I end up picking up a brooch from Zara. Now the brooch is really, really nice, but the little, the pin on the back, I feel like it's a little flimsy, but the brooch itself is nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and elevate the sweater so you guys can see how this can transition through your wardrobe. Okay guys, so this is the next look with the neon sweater. So this is how much stretch that's in it, okay? And this is in the large. This is how long it is, okay? So you can size down in this because it is super, super stretchy. So let me show you guys the brooch up close, okay? So the brooch is really, really cute. It has like a little weight to it. I just think that the actual pin in the back is a little flimsy, but I think the brooch is cute. So I feel like the brooch gives the cardigan like a little extra oomph. And I have on my stirrup leggings and my white mules. Went back to my Chanel bag. So like this is a way that you can kind of tone the sweater down, but also elevate it. And I feel like this gives like a retro look. So how do you guys feel about this? So again, you could wear this to dinner. And you could also wear this to the movie, just switch out the shoes for like a chunky boot and take off the brooch. So that's like another way that you could wear this. You could also pair it with like some faux leather leggings. I think that would be cute with like some Dr. Martens. So that's another way that you could style this. So how do you guys feel about this one? Okay, so let's get into the last look in this piece that I'm about to show y'all is the whole reason why I'm doing this R haul. This piece I'm about to show y'all is the whole reason why I came home from work, unboxed my stuff, and got on camera because when y'all see me start up this next piece and you can't get it, you're going to be mad. Okay? <laughs> you're going to be mad. So, when I link it down below, go get the thing. Let's bow our heads and pass around the collection plate. Okay? Let me y'all spin. Do y'all need one more spin? Okay. So, I picked up this bone color faux leather jacket from Zara, okay? This is plus size friendly. It is in a double XL, okay? This is plus size friendly. So it's an oversized faux leather jacket in a double XL. This is how much room I have in the sleeves, okay? And of course I can zip in it, but I just don't want to zip in it right now. And I just have it paired with that black shirt again and then my cargo pants. And it matches my cream boots to a T, okay? So again, from the back, this is the detail with the zipper, okay? Now, I don't know if you guys follow them, but the Silent Twins, they are on YouTube and Instagram. I think they're probably on TikTok too. So I missed this jacket on Zara, okay? So they did a reel and one of them, I can't tell them apart, okay? <laughs> one of them had this jacket on. And when she said, Zara, baby, I ran to Zara. And I feel like it's a good price point for a faux leather, you know, bone jacket. Like it's only $89.90, which I feel like is a good price. So Ooh, these pockets are deep. Okay, so the pockets are deep. Yeah, y'all. This is the um this is a good photo of the jacket. I just don't want to get no makeup on it. Let's see how it looks zipping up. Okay, so this is how it looks zipping up. Okay, so again, double XL is an oversized faux leather jacket, plus size friendly. So you guys see how much room I have in the body of the jacket, 
how much room I have in the arms. So I am a 16, 18, more so at 16, depending on the store. But I would say if you are at least up to a 22 and maybe like a small 24. And if you have like, I think if you have thicker arms, you'll be okay. Cause I have a lot of room in the sleeve, like a lot of room. So this is plus size room y'all. So if you made it to the end and you guys can see like I have big arms but they're not like super huge, but child, I ain't measure them and, I don't, and I'm not going to measure them, okay? <laughs> Just trust me, it's plus size for me. So and it has like a little stretch in it, but this is a must, okay, for the fall winter. So if you made it to the end boo, Thank y'all, okay? So, the next video, I'm just, I put up a poll to ask you guys if you want to do AliExpress haul or cider. And so far, cider is winning, but it's kind of like in a tie. So, I may end up getting like a couple pieces from both into a collector poll and just style it up. So, we'll see who actually wins. But until the next one, bye y'all. Love you.